Good morning, afternoon or evening, depending on where you are. My name is Josie and I've lived in Thailand for four months now and I still have not had KFC. So let's go see what it's like in Thailand. So we have some chicken pop, we have a shrimp donut over there, we have a famous zinger burger at the top which I actually haven't ever had before, not even at home, so I might need Michael's help as to whether that's the same or any different than in Australia. I have like a chickeny bowl here and it, I think it's spicy so that might be fun to watch. Then you have this chicken bun thing. Uh, I saw it as I was leaving and it's just I think a bun with chicken on it. Then we have some wings I think in here So I have a couple of original recipe and also some hot ones as well And then I've got some wings also and then over here we have chips Which already look a little bit different than home at home. They're really thick cut and then we have a famous Portuguese tart. Now I do want to try the coffee in comparison to Macca's coffee. If you haven't seen my McDonald's video, watch this one first and then go back and watch that one. I'll leave it in the description or on the top of the screen right now. So first thing I'm going to try is this popcorn chicken. I'm used to calling it popcorn chicken because that's what we call it at home, but here it's called chicken pop. So let's see if it's any different. I like it more. Mm. So the difference that I notice off the bat is popcorn chicken at home is a very like it's a bit spicy. <laughs> it's very round and they all are kind of almost the same size and everything um, and kind of like more fried if that makes sense. They're a lot darker color than this but this looks really yum and they're all just different like sizes and like shapes. I think that's cool. <coughs> <coughs> Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with something, the things that aren't spicy because I think if I have them, then the spice, then if I have the spicy things first, then I won't be able to taste the things that aren't spicy. So let's try this one, this little chicken bun thing. So this just looks like a bun with some chicken, some fried chicken on the inside with maybe some mayonnaise on the outside. So let's try this. <laughs> That's so good. This is so good. This is so, I might eat this one by myself. <laughs> the mayonnaise with chicken and a, like bread. I don't think you can go wrong with that. I don't think you can go wrong with that. That is 10 out of 10. Okay, let's try this original recipe. I do love the KFC original recipe from home. Just the crunch of the skin and everything. So it's so juicy. What? That's actually good. I think the skin at home is a tad like, kind of like crispier. This one's a little bit more soft, but I guess it varies chicken to chicken. Um, but the taste is very similar, if not the same. Well, I mean, it's juicier. Yeah. I was gonna say, and hopefully Thailand can prove us wrong, but I think the best KFC I've ever had is in Bali, Indonesia. Indonesia in has Bali? The, Indonesia has the best KFC. Okay, so this is a big difference for me because at home, the thing that everyone loves about KFC is the thick cut chips. They, I don't know, have some kind of amazing secret delicious salt on them and they're really thick cut. These look like McDonald's chips or Macca's chips. Whoa! I don't like them. Oh no! They don't have like that, that like thick cut, salty taste like the KFC chips do in Australia. They're not bad, but I do prefer the thick cut chips. I can't really taste the salt as much as on these ones. So if you do go to Australia or if you do travel to Australia, make sure you try the thick cut KFC chips because they're delicious. So this is a shrimp donut. Obviously it's got shrimp on the inside and it's deep fried and it's in the shape of a donut, a round ring. So let's try this. I actually kind of like it. <laughs> what? To be completely honest, it looks a bit not nice <laughs> but it tastes good if you see the inside bit there it just looks like a little bit of like pink flesh <laughs> we don't have these in australia so this was very interesting to find on the menu that's for sure 
don't love it. Okay, so everything from here on out is spicy. So I'm gonna have this <laughs> coffee handy and I might actually try a sip first just so I can taste the coffee before anything else. So it's a latte. Oh, that's good. Okay, I was about to say it's like so much better than Macca's coffee, but I just sort of got like the back end taste of like it and it's kind of similar. So, um, hmm. Oh, and this is how I order my coffee in Thailand. I say, well, this is a latte, but normally I'll say espresso yen and then I'll say, my say nam tan, my say nom con wan. The same level as Macca's, I would say. And I think this is a lot cheaper though. I think this is almost half the price. All right, we're gonna try the Zinger Burger. I haven't had one before. I don't often get KFC at home in Australia either, but let's see what this is. It looks like a fried bits of chicken with some lettuce and then obviously some mayonnaise and some bun, obviously, to make the burger. This actually looks really yummy. That's good. That's real good. That's delicious. This is really good. Why have I not had one of these before? I've never had one. Hold on, that was a little bit spicy. This is the obviously best seller. This is spicy chicken. And if Thailand says it's spicy, it means it's spicy. So I'm a little bit scared. Oh, the skin is so crispy, that's so nice. That's spicy. It's spicy, that's spicy. But I will say, it doesn't look as spicy as this next wing. So, whew, I'm a little bit scared. I can see the chili on this one, so I'm a little bit, no, scratch that. I'm a lot scared for this one. <laughs> it looks really spicy. Okay, I'm scared to eat this, but it's basically a wing, a spicy wing. I'm more of a drumstick kind of gal, not a wing girl. Let's try, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, that's spicy. That's the spiciest one so far. My mouth's on fire. <laughs> Honestly, it tastes really good. Like the seasonings and the, and the stuff on the top of the skin, um, tastes really good. It's made my lips go numb, but other than that, other than that, the taste of it is actually really nice. Okay, so my camera ran out of battery, but we brought the rest back. And now we're gonna keep trying. It's a little bit all over the place now, but we have the bowl of chicken and rice with what looks to be like onions and some spices and probably a lot of chili. <laughs> so I'm a little bit concerned and I'm a little bit scared. Dun, dun, dun. Let's just do it. Oh no. A whole bunch of chili with some rice and chicken. <laughs> ah! Ooh. Uh. I can literally see it now that I've uh, looked at it and even the like onions are covered in chili. Can you see that? If I didn't have time to like go to a night market or something like that, this wouldn't be a very bad option. Like it's actually not bad. I kind of actually like this. Besides the fact that it's very, very spicy. I actually kind of like it. All right, the last thing we have here is a famous Portuguese egg tart. Now, apparently KFC does the best ones of these. <sighs> Sorry, spice. <sighs> okay, I've still got a lot of spice in my mouth, but that's okay. That's good. <laughs> that is good. Mm. That's really good. The like egg tart is like soft and like mushy and like still warm, even though we drove all the way home. That is an impressive Portuguese egg tart. That is a really good Portuguese egg tart. That's my favorite thing all day. That is the winner, winner, chicken dinner. That is the best. Okay, so that is everything that I got from KFC Thailand today. Let's go through and talk about what we got. So first of all, we tried the chicken pop, which at home we call popcorn chicken. That is a straight 10 out of 10 for me. They weren't spicy, they were delicious. I loved it. Love them. Chick bun, chicken bun. So I'm gonna give that also a 10 out of 10. That was amazing. That was just like, like I said, bread, sauce, and chicken. 
You can't go wrong. So the other thing I had was a Zinger burger, my first Zinger burger ever. And I'm going to give that a strong 9 out of 10. That was really good. It wasn't spicy. You had some lettuce, you had some sauce, and again, you had bread and fried chicken. How can you go wrong? So the other thing I had was the original recipe chicken. I'm going to give that just like a solid probably 7.5 out of 10. I think it was really good. Actually, you know what? I'm going to give it an 8 because the ones at home would probably be a 7. And this one was a lot juicier. So I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10. The spicy wings. Now, aside from the fact that they were super duper spicy, they were really nice. I think they had a really nice sort of seasoning. The other thing that I had was the original recipe, but the hot and spicy version. It was pretty much just a spicy drumstick. I'm going to say 7 out of 10 because I liked the original recipe better. All right, so the coffee. I'm going to give that a 6 out of 10, but I'm also going to give the Macca's one like a 6 out of 10. I think they're, oh, I did like that one though, but did I like it more than the Macca's one? I'm going to give it a 6.5 and I'm going to, and I'm going to give the Macca's one a 6. So the shrimp donut. Now this one's really confusing because it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be, but I would probably give that a 6. Would I have it again? No. Am I kind of glad that I tried it? Yes. Now, the king of the show was the Portuguese egg tart. That was amazing. That was so good. That was an 11 out of 10. I don't think I've had a better Portuguese egg tart in my life. But also tell me, what's your favorite thing from KFC in Thailand? Let me know down below. Like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. That really helps my channel. It really helps me be able to keep making content for you and eating food so you don't have to. <laughs> but thank you so much. And remember, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.